Hey beautiful ones, it's your girl Jodine, the Hustling Homebody, and welcome to my channel. On my channel, you'll find travel videos, lifestyle videos, productivity videos, and grad school specific videos. In today's video, I'll be bringing you a haul, and this will be a haul of the things that I bought in October. It's a mini haul, like a tiny, teeny little, teeny little bit, you know, tiny, tiny, tiny haul. Um, but I wanted to show y'all what I bought this month. My neighbors are gone, so this means that there will be no lawn mowing in this video! <laughs> hey beautiful ones, it's your girl Jodine, the Hustling Homebody, and welcome back. It's October, or by the time you see this, it'll probably be November. But as usual, I wanted to come back with y'all to show you my October buys. In my last video, my September video, I showed y'all the items that I bought from black owned companies. And this will be a video like that. Actually wearing one of the things that I bought as promised. Um, yeah, I'm still kind of adjusting to how it looks, you know, kind of like, hmm. we'll see, we'll see. But anyways, one of my goals right now is to be taking the items that I typically use, typically buy and replacing with black owned companies. I specifically love buying from black woman owned companies and I'm totally here for that. These two companies are both black women owned. Yes. So you already know we're here for it. We're really, really here for it. In case you haven't noticed, I'm also wearing these glasses. They were not the ones that people voted on. So I typically do not wear them, but I figured I might be filming in them. An overwhelming vote in favor of the other pair of glasses. If you haven't watched that video, definitely check that out. Um, but so now I'm going to try recording these because I wear the other ones all the time and I still want to wear these. So this is my first video and this will probably be my first time like wearing, wearing them. So we'll see how that goes. I'm excited to show y'all what I got. Um, there'll be products that I'll have to update you about eventually in terms of how I like them, how, they, how it's working. I think the same would be true. The same could be said about some of the items in my September haul. Um... And even some of the items from my black owned candle haul. So if you haven't watched any of those videos, I have a video right now of black owned buys for September. I have a video of candles, my black owned candle haul. I love candles, one of the main items that I'm swapping out right now. So of course, when you're done watching this one, make sure you go check that out. Okay, so of course, y'all already know unboxing lifestyle happening here. So I have two items for y'all. So this is from one company and then this is from another company. All you need is love and Hana Hana. I can never ever pronounce these things. I need to practice before. You know, I need to be like, let me practice the words I'm going to say in this video. But yes, so this one is from Hana Hana Beauty. And this is what it looks like. Pretty general package. Yeah. And then the other one is from Rosen. Rosen. Okay, they both came through USPS. I was like confirming that as I said it like nobody wants to be a liar on camera so this month when I was thinking about purchases there were literally things that I was running out of or I needed to swap so you'll see that all these items are pretty uh, reasonable purchases one of them was kind of like a want a little bit and the other two are kind of needs needs so I'll explain them as we go along but I'll open this one so as I said this one's from Rosen and it has a little perforated that's how you say it. perforated y'all know what i'm saying little piece so i didn't have to use the scissors i know y'all be worried about using the scissors i promise you i'm safe though then the last like wrapped a little bit i want to show y'all this so they have like little women not little women but they have women on them it's like there's a group of women all right <laughs> So I'm wrapping it and this is what I got. It's a Tropics toner. So it's from Rosen, like I said, that's the company that's from. It's Tropics toner, it has hyaluronic acid, kojic acid and pineapple extract. Hydrating toner helps fade scars and dark marks, which is great because after my time of the month last month, I have some dark spots happening here, not cute. But um, I'm excited to use this because I've been using Witch Hazel and I was like, okay, it's about time that I make this swap. I don't want any more people coming for me. I I wanted to support a black owned company. I knew that I needed witch hazel 
no witch hazel i knew that i needed a toner so i decided to try this one from rosen i will say that i found this company a little bit pricey i went in hoping to get a toner and a moisturizer i still do need a moisturizer because i'm running out of the one that i have so i just want to replace one of the ones that i have but i was like let me start small because as you can see this product is pretty small and it was not cheap yeah so this is the first thing that i got it says take a trip to the tropics with this fruity hydrating toner formulated to help hydrate and fade this toner is geared for folks with slight breakouts texture and scars to fade hyaluronic acid and kojic acid paired together to achieve both of these goals with a splash of pineapple as well i do want that i want to buy some reusable cotton rounds if y'all just reusable cotton rounds and have found a company that you like, put me on, okay? I don't always say how I'm going to put y'all on, but y'all put me on because I still use cotton ones and I want to try some reusable ones, but I just don't know where I want to try them from. So comment below if you do use them and let me know what company you got them from. But yes, so this is the Tropics Toner. So the next company that I got from is Hana Hana. Hana Hana love this little thing it says all you need is love when i saw this when i picked it up outside i was like this is super cute i was here for it but anyways enough of my stories so this one actually does require a scissors so let me do that really quickly all right so this is what it looks like and per usual you'll get to see it first What is that? I dropped something. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, it says there's no need to be ashy. Do y'all see that? There's no need to be ashy. It says, stay smooth and confident. Thank you for purchasing from Hanahana Beauty. Each product is made with love, natural ingredients, and raw shea butter ethically sourced in Tamale, Ghana. You can trust that every purchase you make directly impacts and brings visibility brings visibility to the women who power the global shea in industry sometimes i think i'm good at pronouncing words and then I, I come on camera and i'm like sis but yeah there's no need to be ashy this is so cute it's just pretty much a general box like i said and just brown paper like that oh that's an item and this is an item and then yeah empty box so i'll start with the bigger item the first thing that i got from hana hana beauty is a shea body butter and it's in the scent vanilla lavender it has ingredients shea butter cocoa butter mango butter grapeseed oil avocado oil almond oil coconut oil hemp oil jojoba oil and love wow and it's handcrafted in chicago i love that because it was like a local too benefits yeah i feel like i can smell all of the ingredients listed here so after shower massage this butter into your skin for long lasting moisture that keeps you feeling smooth and confident benefits our body butters have been formulated with butters and oils guaranteed to feel moisturized hydrated and bring glow back into your skin i love it it smells very relaxing um i'm excited to use this i will probably make it a part of my self-care routine i use two other lotions right now but i do not have a body butter and i was excited to try a body butter especially as winter comes you see this there's no need to be ashy okay and once we're doing that as much as i'll be inside this winter because the pandemic i um want to care for my skin while i'm here so i bought this one and i'm very excited to be able to use it right, so this one was kind of a something nice for myself body care item versus the toner i like i said i need to i needed the toner so i was like Ooh. and then this one i needed to i'll explain it <laughs> as you can see it's small this is probably the most expensive one i've ever bought but this is a hana hana beauty shea balm look it's a little it's so little <sighs> do you see it's tiny like if you compare it to my thumb it's smaller than my thumb but well, then maybe I just have big thumb. Okay, so the ingredients in this one are shea butter, cocoa butter, honey, beeswax. I can never say this word. Bao, baobab oil, cocoa powder, vegetable glycerin, 
Linolin and love. It seems like it should slide. Oh yeah. Oh, that's interesting. I don't think I saw that coming. But cocoa's in it, so it would make sense. It smells minty, but there's no mint in it. I'm like, what am I smelling? But it smells really good. I don't think I saw that color coming. So, oh, that's so interesting. At least it feels nice on my um on my skin. I don't know how to describe it. I'm gonna have to watch some more videos about where people describe products because anyways, I'll show you my hands what they look like. All right, so this is the one with the the balm on it. This is the one without the balm on it. Can y'all see the difference? Hopefully y'all see a difference. I got the balm because in the night in my nighttime routine, I always put chopstick on. Chapstick? How do y'all say that? Chapstick or chopstick? But y'all know what I'm saying. I always put it on at the end of the night and I have a specific one that I use because I don't like, I have a daytime, y'all might think I'm a little dramatic, but I have a daytime one and there's one in my desk and I have one in there that I set the morning with and then I have a nighttime one that I use, you know, and it ran out. I was super sad to see it go, but I was also very proud of myself because I'm not typically the type of person to go through a whole chopstick. Either I buy another one lose one or yeah so i was very proud of myself that i finished that chopstick very proud so i wanted one that i could use at night my thing about night why i use a different one at night is that it's after i wash my face everything's like clean sometimes i just did a lip scrub i just you know i want to use the one that is only for nighttime for my nighttime lips extra moisture all of that versus in the daytime you know you've done a bunch of different things in the daytime you're running around you ate this you did that you ate this you did that so i just like being able to have one at night that's like my nighttime this is like a little a little slime for me okay this one was five dollars so it's it's definitely something for me you know it's okay it's all right so i got this one and then i got the hanahana beauty one and i think this was 20 over 20 dollars so it's like 24 26 so i might have been under budget i'll try and put the prices in and then show you the total of what i got but these are the three things that i bought this month this is what i bought aren't they cute well then these are the three things that i bought i'm super excited about them and I will let y'all know. I'm still thinking through what I want in November because I have some items that I need to replace. Like I said, y'all, if there are any companies that you want me to try out, that you've seen, that you loved, definitely comment below and let me know. I'm down to try some new products. Like I said, I'm swapping things in, swapping things out. Here for the self-care item, here for just a different regular item. Just truly here for it all. So thank y'all for watching this video. If you haven't yet, make sure you like this video, press that subscribe button, join us, join us, and of course, share with friends. Until next time, y'all. Bye.